Hello everyone, this video is actually an AMD version of the previous video from a while back about the Discord camera fix. So a lot of you don't have and have also requested that I do a non-RTX version of the video. This works for NVIDIA GPUs that are not RTX as well. It's a very simple fix. Let's go ahead and jump into it right now. First, we're gonna to navigate to the Prism Live Studio website. From there, you're gonna select product and then where it says Prism Lens, you wanna download the desktop app. You simply launch it. Make sure you're on Prism Lens 1. It doesn't matter which one, to be honest with you. So you're just gonna pick one. You're gonna to go to device and, and choose your camera. In this case, mine is an Insta360 link. I click it and boom. There's the camera, it works. Now, before we jump into Discord, I wanna show you a couple small features. You do have an option to blur your background just like NVIDIA broadcast. Look at that, that actually looks really good. Now, as far as that, let's say you're in a hurry, you notice that because this is a virtual effect, it's gonna have a little bit of a, of a FPS hit to your OBS recordings or streams. So make sure you don't turn it up too high. They also have the remove background option, so you can use that, have a virtual green screen. They have a bunch of different little pictures and even videos on here that you could use as your background. In my opinion, for my system, I don't think it looks that great. I think our actual green screen would work better, but the blur feature I did find works pretty good lightly. Now, let's go ahead and jump in how to implement this into Discord. So just like before, you're gonna to navigate to the voice of video under your Discord settings. Then you're gonna go down to the video settings. You're gonna choose Prism Lens 1, because that is the one we are using, Prism Lens 1. You're gonna choose it and test the video to make sure it's working, and there I am, including the effects. Let me move this to the side. We are gonna try one of the remove background. Boom, there I am. Now with this being said, if you notice, my camera resolution in my software has not changed. So this actually works perfectly. Now with that being said, there are options. If you notice that your camera is in 30 frames, what you do, you just go to the camera properties right here and you can adjust the resolution, the FPS that your camera actually does. Mine at 4K only does 30 frames. If I do 1080, which I'll just show you really quick. If we do 1080, I can change it to 60 frames. Boom, give it a second. And there it is, now it's a 60 frames. Though this video is in 30, I'm in 60 frames. So that's where you adjust your, your settings right there. And there you have it. It's that simple and easy to use. And this works for any AMD GPU, as well as non RTX version of Nvidia GPUs. I haven't tested it and I can't clarify if this works for the Intel. That's something you're just gonna have to try on your own. I honestly just don't know. I really hope that this video helped you out. Make sure you subscribe to help the channel out. Have an awesome rest of your week. Happy holidays. Stay hydrated, stay warm, sign word out.